Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. In this video, we got a Pixel 7 tutorial. Um, so you'll probably realize that on the Pixel 7 by default it comes with gestures straight out of the box. In this video, I'm gonna show you how to get the classic, you know, three button layout at the bottom of the screen. Cause this feels like the classic Pixel experience in my opinion. Also you get that nice haptic feedback when you press each of them, easy to bring up the app drawer, stuff like that. So without further ado, I'm gonna show you guys how to actually. All right, so we're on my Pixel 7. First thing you wanna do guys is uh, just hop over to the settings app. So you can swipe up, hit that settings icon right there. Now, what you're gonna wanna do is uh, you're gonna wanna search in search. Uh, you're gonna wanna search gestures. So we have system gestures. It's gonna highlight gestures right here. You wanna click on that. And then you wanna go to this one right here, the setting called system navigation. Hit that. So by default, you're gonna get gesture navigation on the device. This is where you can just like swipe up. Now that's fairly new, um, but if you want that nice classic pixel experience, I recommend going with the three button navigation just cause Although this is more fluid, I do like the older design. I used to have this on my LG phone. I had this on my Samsung phone. It just really feels like classic Android. Now, you can also do some customization. That's what the setting icon is over on the right-hand side. Under gesture, you can adjust um, like sensitivity and stuff. I wouldn't mess around with this too much. Um, you can also invoke the assistant if you swipe up from the corner. However, we're gonna be focusing mostly on the button navigation. Now there's like barely any settings within here, but I recommend turning this one on too for holding down for Google Assistant. So that's basically you're holding down the home button for the Google Assistant. I'm gonna tap on that. As you can see, the buttons themselves pop up. Now you'll get that nice classic pixel feel. You'll also notice the background I'm rocking in this video. This is the classic Pixel 2 uh wallpaper can i can't i couldn't believe that this was still on the pixel 7. um the pixel 2 xl was actually the first device to introduce sort of like a larger display with smaller bezels and now with the pixel 7 it's even better so that's basically it guys now you'll have these navigation buttons in any app you go into as you can see i'm on like amazon.com scrolling through and you can go back Hit the home button, you'll get a haptic feedback here. Hit the square to bring up the, you know, all your most recent apps that you're using. Although it's kind of weird how on the Pixel phones, there's still no way to clear all here. Anyway, that's a side note. And if you hold down, you'll get the Google Assistant, which is awesome. So guys, that's gonna be it for this tutorial. Hope you all enjoyed. Um, if you did, leave a like on this video. If you have any more uh, Pixel 7 questions, leave those in the comment section down below. I'd happy to help out with them. Um, and so yeah, go Pixel 7, awesome device. See you guys in the next video. Peace out everyone. Hey guys, thank you so much for watching another video on my channel. If you're interested, click over here to subscribe to the channel and click over here for another amazing tech video review slash tutorial. And uh, yeah, thanks so much for checking out the channel. Appreciate all you guys. See you in the next video.